two awesome ways to actually find the files that you're missing or large files on your system. Here you're going to see that I have what's called a smart folder. This folder is searching for files that are one gig or greater. So I created this and I'm just going to click save. I'm going to create a new smart folder and I'm going to search for scripts on my system. I want to find all these scripts. So I'm going to go to file extension. There are plenty of other options that you can do for smart folders. So definitely go through this list, find your favorites. I mean, this thing is packed with stuff. So you just select them and they'll show up in the list. I just want to use one that's already in there called file extension. I'm going to do .sh. And what you're going to see is you're going to notice that it's showing me two scripts that are on my system. If I click save on this, I can name it scripts and I'm going to add it to the sidebar. Now you're going to see it here. I'm going to hold down option so I can drag it up by my other smart search. If I don't want this in the sidebar here, I can click control remove from sidebar and now it's gone but I can actually still use it so if I were to open up spotlight type in scripts you're gonna see that it's right here I can click on it it opens my hidden basically save search if I want to delete that now I can hit control show and closing folder on the other one come to this file command delete and it's gone get to that location quickly I can come here and just show you it is in my library folder save searches and that's how you can delete them and remove them from the sidebar I'm gonna hop into the terminal and show you a couple advanced ways to find these files so we're gonna use the find command I want to do sudo because I want to do it with elevated privileges so that it can search all the locations and I want to search the entire drive and then I'm going to do dash I name to make a case insensitive dot star sh so I'm searching for all files with dot sh and then I'm going to do a dash exec ls minus l h a and because I just want to see the information about these scripts and then I actually want to do a two out to uh, slash dev no. And what I'm doing here is I want to send all the errors for locations I just can't search. I don't want to output them to the terminal. I'm going to hit return. And now it's showing me all these other scripts that are on my system. If I wanted to go find these, I can just follow the path and open up that location and copy the script out. But what we're going to do, we're going to arrow up. I want to copy all of these scripts out to a different folder on my system so I have them to play with, right? So I'm just going to do a copy, curly brackets, and then I want to do desktop and I've got a scripts folder on my desktop so now this is gonna go find all those scripts and copy them to my folder if I hit return I'm just gonna let it run and bring this over we'll go over to my desktop you're gonna see this populate with all the scripts on the system Thank you for supporting the channel. I appreciate you. Y'all have an amazing day. Take care.